Hello everybody, one in the world, it's Carmen, this time the English version. <laughs> 21st and I'm in Hinkley and check this out. It's the post office and then here is the newly opened Coco Cafe globally inspired bakery and coffee house. She and, and here, <laughs> now I'm switching for a minute to English, the beautiful owner, Thank you. Laura. <laughs> Hello, how are you doing? Okay. Good. Good. Thank you for visiting us today. Come on okay. In. And I have to say I, I saw this here in multiple languages and of course here of Tabuna, mm -hmm. Romanian. Yes, <laughs> we are a global bon inspired bakery and coffee house, so we want to represent all sorts of cultures and traditions and flavors. That's great, that's great. So this is the area where people Yes, we have a, a seating area here. We have a number of merchandise shelves with local vendors and vendors oh. from throughout the world. We're not a gluten-free kitchen, but we've got gluten-free mixes. We have okay. coffee from local roasters, um, mustard from yeah, local that's awesome. uh, vendors too. Okay, check this out. Very nice. And then the main attraction, oh, we'll get back to that uh, vault. <laughs> Okay, so here is where the magic happens. We have an open kitchen, so uh, you can see our bakers hard at work making fresh breads and pastries and uh, all the good things that, that come out of there. Okay, so whoever comes here to order something, they also can... They're part of the experience. Yes, we yeah. have many children come straight to these windows. Yeah, they are. And I'm, I'm sure they're attracted to, yeah. to see... Oh, and adults. adults. And, <laughs> and adults too, for sure. Yeah, that's, yeah. that's reality. Check this out. Oh, and the smell, it's... So that's our what? potato bread coming oh. out right now. And we had sourdough come out just a little earlier. Mm -hmm. yeah. I right see that on the side. Mm -hmm. Beautiful. Okay, and here, here we have our crepe station. Ah, so are my fa you can ask my friends. They have no crepes are my favorite. Yeah. <laughs> we have sweet and savory. So even if you want it for a breakfast or for a lunch, mm -hmm. just for dessert, that's that's good. We, we just, as I said, I mean we are not here for the opening because we were in Dominican, and I took a video and a picture <laughs> of a crepe with delicious fruits in it, and it's just. Uh, it's just amazing. And uh, I see you have tea also. Yeah, you offer tea. And we've got tea. Yeah. Okay. And here, these are uh, chicken borek and chicken empanadas. Oh. So borek is a Serbian. The Serbian. Yeah. Serbian I wanted to say yeah. <laughs> specialty and empanadas, obviously Latin American. Yes. <laughs> and we have muffins. muffins. And you have different different type. Can I ask you what's this? I see some green. This is pistachio. Okay, so yeah. it wasn't just made for St. Patrick's Day. No, 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 no. <laughs> and it's delicious. It's got walnuts oh. in it too. We've got lemon poppy seed next. Mm. And then we've got the healthy version with the carrots and the coconut and the okay. walnuts. It looks so good, you wanna think that. <laughs> I know, but it's amazing. Yeah. And this, I have to say, I've never seen this before and I love eggs for breakfast and, yes. and bacon and so this for sure I will. This is all you need, one. right? You've got your bread, your bacon, your eggs. All, all in, in one. All in one. And then um, the sweet Our pastry. famous Russian tea biscuits mm -hmm. and blueberry scones. We've got a lot of croissant-based products. So we ran out of the plain croissant and the pano chocolate and the pano raisin. Oh my God. But we do have our ham and cheese croissant here. <laughs> That's beautiful. I mean, everything you said it just sounds so <laughs> appetizing. It's unbelievable. We have our cinnamon buns mm -hmm. with a touch of orange in them. All right, and then uh, that's the part where the coffee lit up. Uh, the list. Our coffee menus. We have uh, amazing espresso okay. and coffee from a local roaster oh. here in Medina. Interesting. Okay. And you then got the, the list for tomorrow. Well, so she's going to finish the little what's left. And this is the, the magic coffee machine. Yeah. Uh, Laura okay. told me on Saturday that the, that the machine was my <laughs> baby. <laughs> because I just had yeah. to take care of so much. Yeah, no problem. Well, it's, it's good for business, you know, but this is uh, amazing. And what Laura has to take care of business a little bit. Um, I have to tell you this part 
I mean, people who live in Hinckley in, in the area, they know this used to be a bank. And when the building was put for auction, that's when Laura came up with the idea of uh, opening a coffee place, bakery, because Hinckley really needed something like this. And this is the vault, literally. Here was the place. Uh, just quickly, I will glance through. Uh, but you can have a private party there, up to eight people, I was told, and it can be rented by hour. And just the place is really chic and modern, and I love that I can be here and support Laura. We know, I mean, I know Laura and her husband and parents-in-law since they came actually in the United States, so cool. Okay. Um, that's it for now. Please stop by. It's uh, right here, adjacent to the post office building in Hinckley on Ridge Road. And uh, see you soon.